Watch this! Let the hunt begin. I mean, Wandering's pretty... Uh, Freezing is really good if it's even. I think we just keep the two secrets. Secret plan is fine, too. Double Freezing against not even Warlock. So, eh, well. Job done. I think Freezing is just good in slower matchups. Play the card... In the turn. All oh, right. Always huffer. Probably going to be more reliant on Rexar than Zuljin here. This is looking like Rena Warlock, so I probably don't actually want to play the Trackins, which is just fine. We'll go to fatigue here. Here's the Rexar. I don't think I jam that on two. Or six. Well. Wow. Might consider it though. This is pretty good. I wouldn't rely on Rexar. That's that's a good point. The Gul'dan is pretty uh pretty gross. Maybe I'll just play a 4-mana 14-15. That worked last game. It's a turn before... Whoopsie. Two heroes enter, one hero leaves. Oh. Oh, this is going to make a gross defile, isn't it? Not quite. We're safe. Oh, hey, this looks familiar. We'll see if we can outvalue him. Like, prepare for the Gul'dan with, like, a poisonous bloat bat type thing. We're obviously not winning through face damage anymore. Oh, okay. He, Yeah, he's the, um, he's the happy warlock or whatever it's called. This is cute. This has poisonous. Alphine Warlock probably loses to Rexar. Yeah, because I just uh, can keep building beasts. I think they only run one Void Daddy, so... Like, is... Uh, Gul'dan isn't that threatening? No, Monga. Yeah. So the, the Gul'dan is less of a concern. I, I probably can't outvalue him now. How do you know we didn't have any minions? This is big. And it has lifesteal now. Do I need to play it at this point, though? To go unleash into quick shot to kill this and then freeze that. That's not. That's more mana than I have. I, wonder. I feel like making something big is pretty good here. Doesn't really have the ability to contest it right now. The concern I might have is like a um, a fell reaver, but he's used one treachery already. Ow. Four, six, eight. 
I'll probably just kill that while I can, right? I want to hit the button. I can't let that go off another time. This is good. This is great. So we'll just save this for the uh, the Gul'dan. The the only thing like I can still just lose this to a Halfin discard, but. generate some more value because that's what we need that's four mana i'm not playing any of these this turn but i'll just well i don't really care about the void lord do i we play master's call yeah that's a good point i don't really want that silence is fine forgot how that card worked for a minute i thought i was building a beast again and i was confused like how do i how did i get undasta what's going on but i didn't want the undasta because i need this for the uh, the gul'dan We're actually starting to get a bit low. Those are all pretty bad. I wanted some spells. I might have to expend this just to get all this stuff off the board. Or actually, I can silence this and uh, attack in. Hit here. Press the button last because I'm good at Hearthstone. This deals with a big threat. Which I've had some problems dealing lately. We need some healing. So that dies. It's in his res pool now. But if he just... Oh, yikes. Okay. Everyone, get in here. This kills that one. This kills that. I think I just have to give up the Zombeast. I really hate doing that. Otherwise, it's... Uh... I could leave it with just the two attack on board. No, I could clear them all, right? Three, five, nine. No, I can't. I don't have enough mana. The zombie shouldn't generate more patrons. Because it kills them, right? Because they're not going to survive the damage. Two, four, six, nine. I do that. But I take six damage. Yeah, it's just got to be. Got to give up the dream, I guess. Oh, we can live it again. Hog champ. Uh, this is actually better for dealing with the Gul'dan because it answers his. Uh, the answer says Void Lord first. I think I want to set this. 
and attack in case he runs his. I need healing, so that works for me. Hit the button. Gain some life. Play some stats. Still has one more treachery and a Halfian slash Fell Reaver to work through. Yeah. Gold Dan must be buried pretty deep into his deck. Pull out another mistress if he has one. Um, this is just like a fatigue game, right? So play that to fatigue him a bit more. It also breaks his uh, defile shenanigans. There's no reason to like push pressure face right now because he has Gul'dan. Yeah, maybe the di like I did want to get a secret down, but I like reducing the the number of cards in his hand. I do have to get a secret down now, so this is a slight punish for that line. Life drinker. Oh, I see what you're saying. Yeah, that was probably a better... That was a much better build. He doesn't run Hellfire, so I don't need... I need to stop playing around that, in fact, because I have been. He has one Defile left, and... Um, that's about it, right? I think we're good from here, for the most part. We've played around Fatigue for quite a while. I can kill that if I really want to. I think I do do want to avoid him setting up. Let's build a beast first. This is a good one. And uh, this is just fine. I could also give it a pile of stats as a finisher. I don't think three lifesteal is that important i would really like to give it stealth what cards do i need to play around still another dreadlord treachery defile he got something taunty i'm just gonna play it safer i'm pretty committed to the fatigue game plan at this stage might as well just stick with it That hurts. You definitely don't want to draw. This is fine. This is fine. Any just treachery fell reaper? Um, 
I mean, if he has it. But also, if he gives me a that big of a minion, it's going to be kind of rough on him, right? This looks like a Defile play. Probably just doesn't really want to give me an 8-8. Eight eight. Cave Hydra is good with the leech. I'm really liking this fatigue plan. Yeah, me too. Like, we're even right now, and I just... Like, I can add cards to my deck, he can't. I can give my beast lifesteal, it's fine. I also have, like, relevant threats on board that he doesn't. Just fine. I could even go Zul'jin if I want. Is Reno Lock the best wild deck? Probably not. Um, I think there are a lot of uh, better options. Okay, perfect. Let's actually see what we get first. This... I just want to heal for more. You can't attack my face, which is what I care about. Hmm. Hmm. So what cards does he have left? Another dirty rat? Gain some armor. It might just be time to uh to jam the Zul'jin. Is that too hasty? No, uh, let's build some more beasts. This with lifesteal would be nuts. This just wins the game. Uh he played Godfrey. He has a Howl Fiend. That's one card that he has. So one of those is Halfiend. One of them is a Dirty Rat if he runs two, and maybe like a, a Stealth. I, I think I checked for the uh, the second twist. Yeah. Second twist is what I was playing around there. 